Hi, I'm Mayor James Mueller. Thank you for your interest in learning more about the city budget process. The city budget is one of the most important things we do each year. It provides critical resources and funding for the services that you depend upon, like public safety, street paving, and clean drinking water. It also enables us to look ahead to the next year and determine what areas need to improve most and what's most important to our community. That's why it's critical for you to get involved and understand the process of how to do so. Next, our city controller will provide an overview of the process and how you can make your voice heard. We look forward to hearing from you. First, let's talk about the main goals of the budget. The budget exists to ensure that the city resources are spent on strategic priorities of the residents of South Bend. The goal of the budget is to ensure that these priorities, from public safety to street paving to economic development, are reflected in the city's plan to spend taxpayer dollars. The city starts its budget process in late spring. We go through several drafts, collect feedback from the public and council, and then pass a final budget in October every year. Let's talk about revenue. Revenue is all the money that comes into the city every year. This is money we receive for services and fees, from taxes, and from other external partners or governments. The most important revenue source for the city is tax revenue, especially property taxes, income taxes, and gas and vehicle taxes. Together, taxes make up roughly half of all city revenues and fund vital operations such as the police and fire departments. In addition, the city receives fees for certain services, such as utility bills and solid waste collection. Each bill you pay goes back into the city's budget in order to support the continued operations of these essential services. These fees represent about a third of all city revenue. Keep in mind that revenue from services and taxes can fluctuate with economic booms and downturns. The city does our best to project what revenue will look like and plan accordingly. Now let's talk about expenditures, or all the ways the city spends money. Everything from paying a firefighter's salary, to paying rent for a building, to funding parks is an expenditure. We think about expenditures in two categories, baseline expenditures and strategic expenditures. Baseline expenditures refer to money we have to spend in order to keep the essential operations running in the city, operations designed to keep our residents safe and healthy. These include funds for police, fire, street repair, water, and many other vital operations. Altogether, about 85% of our budget each year is dedicated to these baseline expenditures. The other 15% of funds are then allocated to strategic spending. Depending on budget priorities, strategic spending can look different each budget cycle, but generally involves spending designed to promote economic development, culture, or inclusivity in our city. For instance, a strategic spending decision the city made in 2020 was to allocate more funding to the Group Violence Intervention Program and other violence prevention and community building efforts. Some operations involve both baseline spending and strategic spending. Street repair is one example of this. There is a certain amount of revenue from gas tax every year that the city is legally required to spend on streets. However, the city can also choose to spend additional money from income taxes on street repair, especially if residents make it a top priority. In this way, street repair becomes both a baseline expenditure and a strategic expenditure because we chose to put additional funds toward improving quality in that priority area. In order to make the budget most effective, we need to hear from you. We encourage all residents to go to this link to fill out a quick survey about your budget priorities and ideas. This feedback is enormously helpful to the city during our budget planning process. Residents can visit this link to learn more. At this site, you can browse through Financial Transparency Dashboard, look at historical budget documents, and also see our budget FAQs. Thank you for watching this video. We hope you consider participating in the City of South Bend's annual budget planning.